Hello everyone, hope you all are doing well. In today's topic, I would like to start by using this graphics from Sequoia Venture Capitalist. As we speak, a new landscape or new technology landscape is being generated with the name of Generative AI. And by 2022, with the emergence of DALI 2, GPT-3, open source version of DALI, open source version of GPT, and very recently the massive success with Midjourney as well as the stability.ai, now we are seeing that it seems that the generative AI is a space which is getting matured and in next coming years, we are going to see the significant progress in this space. If you focus on this graphics, which is also from Sequoia, you could see that by 2022, the large language models are getting there. It's not, but it's almost getting there. It means it's in the next few years, we are going to see tremendous results by using the generative AI methodology to process images, videos, 3D, and their applications is going to show up into the various businesses, such as gaming, video generation as well as the verticals which are heavily infused with these content by using images videos and 3d content so as the generative ai field is booming lots of new opportunities are being created for everyone so let's take a look at the generative ai landscape and learn how we as programmer engineer designer, creator, entrepreneur can take advantage of this field and make our dream come true. The generative AI landscape is divided into various fields and these fields are text, code, image, speech, video, 3D content and others. It means using generative AI models you could create the content of these given types and to make sure that you could generate the content from generative AI, you need models. So the foundation of generative AI is the model layer where either open source, closed source, proprietary, any kinds of these models are going to infuse or could be the cornerstone for your product. While the upper layer is the application layer. It means the results which are generated by generative AI models in these sections will be consumed. This is the list of models which can be applied in their own segment. These models could be open source, closed source, proprietary. However, depending on whatever their use case is, these models can be used to apply various use cases in this application layer as you could see. Some of the models listed here are open source while some of the models are closed source. Some of the models such as Facebook, no language left behind or the open AI whisper or the hugging face bloom. These are a class of open source models which you could download and get yourself started. If you are new to this field, please do visit my YouTube channel where you could find variety of content available for you to get yourself started. The application layer is filled with so many use cases. These use cases are currently limited to text code in and image segment with a few into the video and 3D. However, a new other category to apply these models into the gaming, RPA, creating music, audio, biology and the chemistry, this guy could be the limit. And that's where the new and new research as well as the new models are going to be coming in next few months to year time frame and you are going to see the application layer is going to be filled as we progress now let's take a look at the given generative ai segments how various startups are bringing their tech into the market First, we are going to start with text segment where several new startups or the existing startups are bringing these models to apply in various categories such as marketing, sales, 
support, generating knowledge content, general writing, or even other categories. Most notable companies are the Jasper as well as the AI12. The product is Tune, where these companies have received the significant funding from venture community that in coming days, more and more venture capitalists are going to show more interest in the fields of generative AI and you are going to see even more new organizations and startups are coming into the generative AI field. The next segment is the code segment. Last several months, we have already seen the GitHub Copilot coming out from beta and is available for anyone to use. Ghostwriter is another model which has been received a significant interest from the market. But in the other spaces outside code generation, such as building the web apps or the documentation, creating the SQL from the text, some of these open source as well as the closed source model are helping newer companies to build the foundation of generative AI in the fields of code generation. The next field is the image. And that is the field which is more crowded because the images are getting much more or the higher attention from the public. So the companies such as Midjourney, Stability.ai, Crayon, Lexica, Alpaca, these are the companies which have already received the significant interest. However, the Stability AI as well as the Midjourney are the front runner in this space. With the recent release of OpenAI Whisper ASR automated speech recognition model, we are going to see even more and more interest from the various enterprises or the entrepreneurs to build newer applications in the field of speech. Some of the well-known companies are Resemble.ai, WellSet, and the Podcast.ai. Similar to image, the video segment is also getting great interest to the some successful companies or some introductory companies such as Runaway, Synthesia, Rephrase.ai where we have seen the results of generative AI from the entrepreneur community in this space. 3D space, we do have some of the NVIDIA models which are generating 3D content but I think as we grow next coming months we are going to see even more interest but the field is not limited there are some companies which are actually trying to build these models in the field of biology or chemistry as well as the audio music gaming and rpa and i believe that in next coming months we are going to see the significant interest so for all the tech as well as the creative folks this is a brand new space where they can actually apply their knowledge, their experience, their passion, and they can build new products, new companies, as well as they can also create a new direction because this field is very new. There is a massive amount of growth opportunity. And not only that, there, this is the place where you can not only build your dream, but you can also make your dreams come true. So that's all for now. I do appreciate your time and I'm looking forward to seeing you in my next video. Until then, thank you so much.